Hello guys, welcome back to Sisters Talk TV. I just want to make this intro really short. So, of course, Basketball Wives came on last night and OG has decided to scatter this whole franchise up into pieces. OG says she is tired of these ladies creating a narrative that does not belong to her. So OG has exposed pretty much the whole cast and she like I said she has just scattered this whole franchise into pieces to the fact that Sh to the point where Shawnee had to even leave and of course the collectives had to follow behind Shawnee because we know Shawnee is the ringleader so because Shawnee left everybody had to leave so OG took matters into her own hands and she exposed the whole conversation between Je um J of course Jennifer Jackie Christie Malaysia and Kristen and I'm just like why do they not show this on the episode like this conversation was needed because like so many things like we of okay as a viewer, I didn't really understand like what was going on. I was like, what is actually going on? And of course, like the crappy editing, they edited this whole conversation to a point where it was just like, it just made OG look really, really bad. And we've already discussed that. Like the editing is just making OG look really bad. I wish they would have put this unedited version. And I'm really like happy that OG's actually you know, telling her own truth and that's how it should be. Never let anybody tell your own narrative for you. So just take a listen to this audio that OG has decided to ex just allow us to like listen, especially viewers to kind of listen like to like what is actually like going on. So take a listen to that. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you guys so much. Please be sure to like and subscribe to our videos. Also, check us out on Instagram at Sisters Talk TV. No Texas. I don't know. Did it be to the PLB? Shock when uh, a demon walks through the door. A demon? Yeah. No, that not be no demon. But so oh, we got her back to the door. I got eyes on the back of my head. Yeah, I know that's right. <laughs> that third eye? Girl, thank you. <laughs> you gonna have to drink baby? Emily, but it smells what does that smell? It smells like a liquor. Is your is it is it your smell? <laughs> it is. I'm still like, it's like, it. Yeah, it's yeah, like it's a dark it's like a, a, a chocolate take. Like, do you don't want to see us here? Oh, okay. So everybody can do whatever they want? No. Okay. Yeah. Girl, because you yeah. know what you want is gonna be in your bed. No, I'm just saying I don't want to like, I don't know if we all have to go outside. Or yeah, we, we all have to. No, we can move. We, we need to be out there, like, being active when they come. I was. Okay. Okay. So, I know it's a tense moment and everything, you guys, because I've invited over the other girls. But I'm excited because I think it would be a good time for us to kind of, like, mesh together. You know, I've been over there twice. I'm tired. I want them to be able to come over here. I done got this beautiful house for all of us. And see how we do it over here. Because this is some sexy shit over here. Yeah. So... If you guys want, we can go outside and relax, and they should be coming very soon. So, I'm gonna grab me a water. Okay. I'm not drinking. Okay, you know how to set this up? Because you know how to do all this. I do. Do we got a table? Huh? Do we got a table for it? I think it's good. Oh, that's, what is that? Oh, that's the, like, the happy sack? Okay. We gotta utilize some of this stuff. <laughs> Jackie, are you sitting on the are you sitting on the Fendi? Mm -hmm. Jackie, are you sitting on the towel or here? Oh no, I just set my stuff okay. down here. I just put it out here. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna, we gonna get active. Come on. I'm gonna watch you guys. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I, don't know. I mean, I used to have a kid. Mm -mm. Well, I gotta keep these light. That's my favorite movie. Yeah, I remember. What? What kind of game is that? Which way? Pack Which way do you want to set it? I've never played that before. Me either. I'm like, I don't. I think you like toss something. I never. I don't know what that means. Not. This is a a beanie bag toss. Okay, good. Oh. Okay. Oh. I'm like, you gotta. Jenga is where you pack the the things. 
Yeah, yeah. Ooh, I do want to play that. But I'm going to get out of the place if you're doing that. You ready? I mean, oh, I she's she's good. Good. Yeah. I seen her in uh, <laughs> Costa Rica play. Okay, she was playing it solo, but killing it. Killing it. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. What are you talking about, beanbag? Yeah, you can talk solo. She put that whole thing out. Oh, yeah, we gotta okay. so it's a slow, get, slow process game. I'm oh, playing that. Mind my own. Oh, 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 and that's, Wait. that's, yeah, that's how you do it. You keep stacking it and stacking it and stacking it. Oh, stacking it. so you have and to take one out? Does, you, and then if whoever knocks it down, lose it. So like, see how it's this way, that way, this way, that way. That's how it stays together. So I'm going to go first. So because I brought it, brought it up like this, i got to put it on one end. Don't put it on the middle. You put it on one end. <laughs> Jenga, Jenga, Jenga. I swear I've never played this. You've never played Jenga? No. Girl, I have like six oh jumbo God. Jengas in my house. <laughs> We're like Jenga time. I'm nervous. I feel like so I, I would take the glass class. off in case it falls or at least oh, you. Okay. <laughs> put it on the table. Okay. You got Thanks it. Thanks for the Yes. <laughs> And so you just like feel around whichever one you think is loose. Yeah, that's it. you think is loose. Okay, there you go. You got one. So now you gotta take it off. But be careful. You knock it down off the second try on the left side. <laughs> I don't know if that's my first time You could grab it from each side. You can fly it like this. You can put both your hands because you need to grab it on the other end when it comes out. There you go. There you go. <laughs> hey, so that's the last time I'm going to help you. So now I'm about to whip your ass. <laughs> oh, sorry. So then I have to play this. Right, never play this. There you go. Oh, Damn, you got that on low, low. Come on, baby. I know. Oh, and then we got to keep stacking it. Yeah, so now the next one will go this way. And it gets high. Like, Tommy and I were playing, girl. It was taller than him. I was like, who's going to lose? We have one at the bottom holding it. <laughs> oh, this is yeah. oh, learning. Come on, we're coming over. Who's winning? Oh, I'm not about it. Right now, it's I know. I've never played this. Okay. Oh, oh, she's good. I love this game. So we all just join in, right? And then the one that fucked up has to take a shot. Okay, you guys, come on. No, no, no. We not. We 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 not the wrong right now. What? Okay. Okay. No, you can't take the top. Oh, you, you have, have to take the top. See, I never did this. Okay. So you gotta find a loose piece. You can tap as many times as you Don't want. Fuck up, Jackie. Yeah. No. If I fuck up, I will take this. You never played this before. I ain't never played this before. Me either. So you guys have never played Jenga. This I'm is crazy. Come on. Come on. Come here, Jackie. Uh, somebody else go. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so you take a piece out. The you can't take no, 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 Sure, whatever. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. At this point, we plan. We make it our own. Just make sure you put on that end. Exactly. Our structure is oh. off like a mug. Oh. Damn. Damn. Why I gotta be moving so? Cause you took you. <laughs> you made this. You made this. Oh, she got a good one though. There you go. Good job. Slide out from me. Who's winning? Me. Everybody, nobody's knocked it down yet. I don't think it's like a. Is it it's a you, it's like, The move is like the loop. Nobody, nobody has knocked these down. Uh uh. And we came a little close, but not yet. We're going strong. There you go. Oh my God. You done played this shit. She's playing. Hey, Jenna, you get all around. I'm looking like my heart is beating. She's getting all around. What? Y'all sound like a No, no, no. So you can <laughs> <get it down laughs> back. Oh, nah, you got it, you got it, you got it, no, you got it. Okay. Uh -oh. I totally had it. 
Why? Well, I'm thinking leave the foundation intact. Come up here somewhere, huh? You can't. You just can't go on top, but she can go right there for sure. Come on. <laughs> this one, come on. I see I come see on. your strategy. She she lives in the middle block. I bring left when I come around, so I know she got it. I bring right in. I can't wait to see what you say. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh. 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 Hey. Hey. You want me to move real quick? Yeah. Okay. If you knock it down, I'm gonna laugh. All right. I'm not. Girl, I'm so sorry. Okay. No, don't go. You 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 Come on, honey. You, you want to drink or you want to drink water? No, I saw it. I didn't mean to knock it over. No, you did well. You did well. Good effort. Valuous. <laughs> Valuous effort. Oh. Hello, hello. Hi, guys. What's going on? How are you? Good, good, good. You look cute. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, OG, how are you? I'm good. How are you, Malaysia? Uh, okay. Good, good. Well... I came over here because I just kind of wanted to like talk to you. Um, I heard like through Instagram and through the other ladies or whatever that you had an issue with the way that you have been treated amongst the collective. And you know, at the reunion, I didn't really understand what you were trying to say. Um, and I want you to understand that when I chimed in, I was saying like, colorism, like what are you talking about, right? And maybe my approach to the situation, because I was taken aback, mm -hmm. was probably off. So um, I just kind of wanted to get some understanding on what your experiences have been, mm -hmm. because if your experiences have like literally came from my way, I want to correct my wrong, if if that is the case, or anyone that you know I associate myself with, I want to be able to say this is where the problem lies. Let's you know correct this so our you know our sister don't feel uncomfortable. So this is me coming to say like you know what is it like? Did I say something wrong to you? Ever. Don't talk about arguments. No, no. With arguments. Can I? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I haven't said anything yet. <laughs> um, as a whole, mm -hmm. when I made that comment, I was speaking as an entire group that I, I witnessed what I perceive to be um, a diminishing of one another. Because I, I, I made it very clear not to say you, you, or you, and point out specific people. I say as a whole, I believe there is a colorism issue in this group, and I still believe that. And as I was explaining to, explaining to Kristen the other night, what it is to me is I witness two different things. I witness people doing the act, and then I witness people co-signing the act. And the analogy that I gave was you're pretty much guilty by association it's like if you witnessed the murder and you didn't call 911, you didn't administer any type of first aid, you're just as guilty as the person who pulled the trigger. That's how I see it. So if you want specific examples, I could take it back to when I was being called Godzilla, aggressive, gorilla. If we fast forward to now, specifically with you, um, it was brought to my attention that when the blogs were posting rumors that I was no longer going to be an active member of this group and the basketball world and this society, 
you had posted, I guess, on your Instagram, one monkey don't stop no show. And I don't know if that was to me, which is why I never said nothing. I never, I never responded. I got tagged a lot. It was forwarded to me by multiple people, and I said, well, it's proximity, so it is exactly when the blog hit the same exact day. However, because she did not say my name, I'm not going to even play into it. So I ignored it. But to me, the fact that that followed right after the other young lady was going back and forth and posted a monkey picture, it aligned up. So to me, correct, correct. So those are the instances. So A, that had nothing to do with you. I don't know if Jackie and Kristen knows me well. I don't follow the blogs. I am not an Instagram chaser. So whatever went out then, I probably knew nothing about. Um, to my knowledge, you and I have never had an issue. So I wouldn't call you a monkey or anything like that. I was going through something on my own and I was breaking up with my friend. So I'm saying one monkey don't stop no show. Like, nigga, I'm gonna move on to the next. That was my own personal shit that had nothing to do with you. So happens it, I guess, you know, it lined up, but it had nothing to do with you. And that's what my children's like. So, again, I feel like, I, I, I can't tell you how to feel, but I'm telling you, from you to me, that why would I celebrate you losing a job? Well, like, that's I what I'm saying, I don't know. When I, I don't was know. like, sitting here like, hey, maybe you should just do this, maybe you shouldn't call that person. Like, I'm not gonna celebrate anybody losing money because it don't make it. Like, I, I'm not that girl. So, no. If you're feeling, treating you of any kind of way as far as like racial wise sometimes people don't know what they're doing or are saying that's making a person feel a type of way so if you could just say like this person called me Godzilla then at least we know where to pinpoint the problem but if you're just leaving it as a broad statement we don't know where it came from because everybody is like I know I didn't do it I did say <laughs> at the reunion, uh -huh. at the, you weren't at the Crystal event. Uh, so yeah, I wasn't at the Crystal event. I did say it at the Crystal event. I said it at the reunion. I said when somebody's calling you Godzilla, Tasmanian devil, I said it in San Diego. When she said, you think you're Godzilla, da 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 you think uh, Phoebe. Okay. When I was asking her about the rap song, mm -hmm. I, I've said it. So um, everybody has different memories, mm -hmm. but I can only be accountable for what I remember and how I delivered it. I know for a fact, I've mentioned it because I'm really big on mentioning things when it's in proximity to when it happens. Mm -hmm. After time passes, for me, I've already moved on. I've dealt with racism and colorism my entire life, which I think everybody might have, whether you know it or not. Some people say, I've never, Kristen said you've never experienced it. No, I don't, I've experienced it. Okay, so you have. Okay, so I, I think it's a consensus. I meant, like, here. Sorry to interrupt you. I meant like in this environment, I've never experienced it. Okay, so I think it's a consensus that in our everyday lives, outside world, it's prevalent. What I don't like is this group, from the moment I met you guys, have talked about my breasts, talked about my feet, talked about my skin, talked about my hair, talked about my clothes. You talked about your skin? Yes. And? Yes. I didn't say who, because we, the, see, the thing that is always like, there's cameras and then there's not cameras. And we also don't know who says what and how they say it, so. All right, so is it okay for the other ladies to talk about, it's not okay for the other ladies to talk about you, but it's okay for you to talk about the other I, I, again, I didn't say anything about being okay or not. I just said what was done. My thing is I just want us to all hold ourselves accountable for our, act for our actions and like, we can't, I'm listening. Move, we can't move on if we're not holding ourselves accountable.
Okay. So, there's any Yeah. Thank so I'm going through a lot. Oh you. my gosh. It's, 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 it's fun. I'm going through a lot of them. About oh. accountability. Hold on, hold on. About okay. accountability. Yeah. Before you start yeah. trying to I'm be good. strong. I'm very like, good. I just have a lot of my plate and let them be. Okay. I got a lot on my plate. It's totally fine. I'm just we all do. Exactly. That's why I'm telling you it's okay because I'm going through it. We don't want to be strong. strong. This makes us feel like we can love on you. And okay. like I'm getting emotional because I don't even think she okay. had that. Mm -hmm. I feel, like, okay. I feel like it's all like you have this wall, okay. and I get why you have your walls. They they are so warranted. Yeah. This is literally like I'm shaking because I didn't know. Can I have a hug? Please? Sure. Because I would never talk. <laughs> <to you. laughs> sure. Mm. I'm serious, OG. Like you gotta stop. Like, you, you have talked to me. I like, did talk to me. It would have been easy for you to slide in my DMs or text me and be like, bitch, what? But now we're like, not you, just no I'm person. still learning, you guys. And what I would wish is that you guys would reciprocate it. I'm very big on holding myself accountable to things. Mm -hmm. When you say you're talking about us, I have done nothing but stand up for myself. I never said nothing about you. You know how that day you went. Said that I, I bleached my skin, and that really I said I control. heard that you bleached your skin. Really hurt my skin. Can I tell you? Can I tell you how that came about? A girl who said she sold you the cream sent me the information, and I said I heard. I'm very choice with my words. I didn't say you bleached your skin. I said I heard you bleached your skin. Oh my, That's what I heard. Oh my children's life, I will never do anything like that to it's, my It's body. okay. I don't care you if you do or you don't, Malaysia. Face. I, but still, you're, but mm. the fact that you said it. That gives it, it gives people the range to roll with it. And so if I'm saying that if I said what I, the things that I hear about you, I would never do that Malaysia. because I don't want, like, I'm just, can I just, this is how I feel. And this is why I was hurt. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not saying, I'm not coming over here because I want a pity party or anything like that. But that hurt me because I'm like, what the fuck? Like, why would you put that jacket on me? You know, like, even them saying that my kids were dirty. Like, don't put that jacket out there. I had to bear a lot of stuff, too. You're not the only one. But I this one is that. a little bit bigger because I don't want you to be around not feeling comfortable. Like, if somebody wronged you or somebody is treating you different because of the color of your skin. And if we're going to be real and mm -hmm. we're going to hold each other accountable, yes, like we do. keep saying it, you have said things about me behind my back. Like what? You've called me ugly. I have never. She did she call me ugly? When 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 specifically at the, the very interview? first time I oh. met you guys. When I wasn't at that, that was you. No, no. The very first time I met you guys. Has Malaysia ever talked about me like a dog or said anything about me? Um, I believe you and her both did. I believe it was the hairs and car. Not and that, that part. Stuff. Before yeah. I even met her. When I went shopping with you guys and I went to go change. I don't remember her saying it was ugly. I remember her saying something like, why are you wearing that shirt or something? I don't why'd you bring her around? Look at her boobs. Yeah, yeah. she did say, but it wasn't why'd you bring her around because we You asked that. me about your shirt, the side boob. She no, said, right. no, you said, would you wear this shirt? I can't remember. And I was like, I wouldn't wear the shirt because yeah, I don't like my boobs. Time, it was I never, I've never said this girl was ugly, yeah, blah, yeah. blah, blah. She looked like a dog. I, that's not me. Now, when we were arguing, I said your wig was in the car. That was that. And even and still in that moment, I had nothing negative to say about you. You came at me, so I defended myself. I said, you have a wig on. I did not make fun you of your like, wig. You and wig can stay here because you have a wig on. I and did not make fun of your wig. You did. Make, that's making fun of me. It's throwing shade that you have a wig You're on. You're throwing shade, making fun, the same difference. Okay, so without the semantics at the end of the day that day you know how that played out you know that that was an invitation to my pool party and i was simply trying to make sure that her and the other one knew that each one was invited so if they didn't want to be in each other's presence they would not have to okay. however it played out it played out and it looked very confusing because you said i was messy and that's where i got defensive when you call me messy and then you try to say call her and i'm letting you know i'm still getting to know jackie i don't even have her number I don't have her number, so, and I'm still getting to know her. I'm, I'm not trying to like slang, you know, who's right and who's wrong in a in a in a scene that was like far back, and yes. 
Like, seriously, I have no issues with you. Even if, like, out here now in the world, everybody thinks that I'm bleaching my skin, I'm okay with that. I don't have to live with that. I'm okay with that. Like, how do we move forward from treating each other like however it is? We got to say each other, say something, because we don't know each other. We right. are getting to know each other, and it's hard to get to know each other with this around. And it's hard to understand if you're being smart, if you're being a smart ass, am I missing the shade? Should I say something? Should I not? You know, if, if I'm being a smart ass, am I missing the shade? Like, it's very hard to have your shit thrown in your face on national TV, whether it's real or fake, you know? It is. So how do we move forward from back then to today? Well, for starters, uh, passing the blame cannot continue. Right. Um, interrupting each to... other cannot continue. Telling each other how to feel or what happened cannot continue. Mm -hmm. Smiling in each other's faces and then talking shit behind each other's back cannot continue. Well, that's I right. mean, you're saying you're saying a lot, and I and I hear you, and I'm receiving it. But at the same time, it's like I sometimes look at you and I feel like it's hypocritical because you said to my face at the reunion, "You're just mad because nobody liked you." Okay, so that's including yourself. So that's being fake to me. So we didn't have no problem. After I said nobody, that did not mean me. I'm saying you're mad. Honestly, I feel like what you were, and this is my feelings, okay? That's why I said I'm coming in here and I'm trying to understand what you feel. My feelings was it was more of a favoritism thing. And what you were taking as favoritism as a like people didn't like you because of the color of your skin no. that's what I that's what I understood it to be people, okay people treated me differently because the color of my skin and that and I was exactly saying what that maybe people was. were treating you different because it's a favoritism thing we all deal with it like some of us has been here for a very long time and some of she us hasn't. yeah but no no I, I explained I kind of explained it to you that night but Malaysia wasn't present it's not the it's the color but to me the baseline is this there are three types of acceptable black women in the industry mm -hmm. there's the black woman who gets to be the class clown all the time and we we'll wa welcome her because she's the one who can be the butt of the joke there's the black girl who is aggressive and we don't fuck with her because she's the angry black woman and then there's the black woman who is Submissive, and I'm not trying to throw shade. I'm saying you came off passive aggressive, willing to do whatever, willing to take this back, willing to take that back, and that's what I was saying. You fit into that category in terms of the complexion pendulum. And then when it comes to features, Kristen, you have Western features. It's not your fault. That's how God made you. Your nose is slender. It's different. I have eccentric African features. So even if you think it's just about the color, it's more than that. It's not just about the complexion. You made a statement, I know it was a while ago, but you made a statement like, you know, at the end of the day, to me, if you are pro-supporting women, mm -hmm. especially if you're pro-supporting black women, which is what you said the oh, yeah. first year I got to know you, I want to see the action. So I'm holding you accountable to the action, not the words. And my experience with you was not support. I, I heard things, I talked to you about it, I was very nice to you every time we encountered each other, whether it was with an audience or without an audience. So when I sat at my house mm -hmm. and watched the, the show play itself out, I was taken aback by all the stuff you said about me on your confessionals behind my back because I was like, that's not who I met. So I felt like I met my met your representative. Um, that's how I felt. Okay, so you can feel how you want to feel, but we all know that throughout the duration of the show when we do confessionals it be different periods so maybe if I said something it may have been in a period where we were not feeling each other um, and yes because me and you don't get along don't mean that I am not pro woman so you can't just take that one scenario and say hey I you know I'm not looking out for all women I didn't say that, but you said it to me, like, I'm for women. But you're saying it right now, like, I am not for women, and I am. I am for, I'm just for all human beings, and I just feel like you are saying, like, you're you're the one that's pointing out facial, fe facial features. You're so pointing out the baseline. Yeah, I know, but you're placing a different 
lens to us right now because we have never talked to each other and picked each other apart and said, you're different from me. I, we never tried to do that. So if that is the case, I'm going to disagree with you. Yeah, I'm just kidding. I don't think we ever had that conversation. I'm None of us. It was kind of like, remember when I came in here and I said the other day, like, when the three of you were sitting down, you and OG and Jen, and I was like, you are all black women to me. Like yeah. I never looked at a, a lighter skin tone or the issue that you said that you felt where I was being um, had colorist to you and I was saying I never stuck this uh, oh, the text messages I'm talking about the text messages remember when you explained to me how I said weird or er, laughs versus disturbing that was the example you gave to me right that was the example I gave to you about the painting the angry black woman which and then it falls into the, the color of the pendulum which, yes. I, which I explained to you was at that moment, I just didn't like you. You know what I mean? But to you, that's why I laughed at her. I'm not saying it's okay. I'm just saying my real honest answer, which I told you the other night, was it had nothing to do with and your when you said your that, what, black, do you remember what I said? I said, Kristen, what did I do to you first? And you couldn't answer that question. In that moment, what did you do to me first? I no, like in general, before. what did we I didn't go do? back there? Remember, we tried to move forward. We went back all the way to your party. No, we're not gonna go back to. We, we, you didn't answer the question. Did she answer the question? She didn't answer the okay, question. Okay, so ask me. Well, I asked. I asked you two questions. Okay. I said, why now? Like, why do you want to talk about this now? That because, that because so much time has passed. Mm -hmm. If anybody wanted to reach me, it's been over a year. Mm -hmm. And I said, the second question was, what did I do to you first? Because. I know for a fact that before I even met you, you guys were Googling me and watching my football fans and already talking about me before I ever met you. Okay, so. Is that a fair statement? That's not, I did not Google you or watch your football films, personally. No. So that has, was something said to me? Yes. And she's not here for me for us to talk about. At all. But did I personally Google you and look you up? Absolutely not. I did have something said to me. However, when I met you, none of that mattered to me. Like, I, I didn't see, I saw a black person coming on with me as a black person. Period, end of story. So here when Jackie and I were at your party, like, you asked me, I thought I, I thought that I answered your question was, we're gonna go back there. I was irritated. Was I not irritated that you can remember three years ago, me and you set up the part, all that. So I was already in a bad mood. Good or bad, and how it played out, we both apologized to each other about the things that we have said. It had nothing. I, I, I hear your how you feel about colorism displayed. Yes, like people could be saying, Kristen got a badass attitude. Well, sometimes I do. Okay. I don't feel like they, if you said that about me, I would be in one of those three categories. I would be fitting maybe how I'm acting at the moment. Does that make sense? No, because I, I'm. I'm I don't think you guys fully understand the definition of colorism and racism. When you try to paint another woman, a black woman, like she is the stereotypical aggressor, okay? You guys never did that to Evelyn. You never did that to Malaysia. You never did that to Phoebe. These women have all said, Phoebe said at the skating room, I'm gonna fucking kill this bitch about Jackie. You never called her aggressive. Malaysia threw a table at Jen and said, I'm not trying but to go to the table. about one situation. Uh, let me finish. A thousand let me finish, please. No, because you're let me finish. I'm not gonna get to the finish. No, because I was like, you guys are me to be the angry person when you, every but other. Now you know how I feel. I'm sick of it too. Well, just say that. But don't, I, I, don't, I'm don't, trying to, but you won't let me finish. I'll let you finish. And let me I, finish. Like, I'm done with the table throwing because let me finish. a thousand other things that I am Malaysia, let me finish so we can have a civil discussion because I've let you guys finish okay. and everybody has said their piece without interruption much. You're right. You're right. You did not do that to, to Evelyn. You guys never called her aggressive. You passively said it was funny. It's okay. Oh, she's just this. She's just that. That is colorism. Okay, so let me, can I, can I interrupt you? I'm not done. Okay, so okay. Go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead. No, I'm go ahead. Bad memory, mommy brain. Go ahead. Go I'm ahead. Sorry. Okay. I'm going to say it right to your face so that it's very clear. Evelyn threw a drink straight past my face. That was aggressive behavior. 100%. I don't need to know that. She needs to know that. I know it's aggressive behavior. You had these conversations with her. 
I don't know that. Okay, I'm just letting you know. Saying, you know that I'm letting you know the way it plays out okay. is that everybody else gets a pass. No. But I'm just true. telling you the way it plays out okay. is that everybody else gets a pass. And I can't even use my words because I'm going to be painted like a Godzilla, gorilla, a monkey, or whatever the fuck you want to call it. Okay, I'm looking at you in your face right now. I don't think any of that about you. That's what I we are saying now. Okay, so let me have now. I don't think you're Godzilla, OG. I don't think that you are ugly. However, I think that there have been times where you and you and me have had ugly behavior. Yes. Okay, and that ugly behavior that we have had from the inside comes out and people say shit in it don't be right. I don't think that you're ugly. I think I've looked at myself and been like, Kristen, that shit ain't cute. It's been ugly behavior. I'm looking at you in your face right now. I do not, and who the fuck am I? If I thought that you were, fuck me. That would be my opinion. And exactly. you should say, fuck me. Fuck all, fuck you, fuck whatever. Fuck it all. Fuck us. If that, whatever it is, you know that you are beautiful, right? You know, I know you. I don't need okay, no, 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 I'm supposed to do if the questions and the answers are not to your liking. All I know is we can agree on certain things, we can disagree on certain things. At the end of the day, your last question was how do we move on from here? And the way we move on from here is every time we erase the, the dry erase board and start anew, we cannot keep repeating the same mistakes. And I told Jackie personally, I said with Christy, after that last talk we just had, I said I'm going to try something different. So that way we can ensure a different result. Mm -hmm. Because what we have been doing is not working. I agree. It's not working. I agree. So that's my effort. Thank you. Thank you. Thank I told you. you. I told them. Jen. Everybody. That's my effort. But only, I can only control me. I can't control what you do. I can't control what you do. I can't control what the group does or the dynamic does. Because let's be honest. Everybody has a little twang when they're around their boot thing. If that's your girl, you kind of have a little different like bop to your step. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing wrong with that, but it also affects the next domino. You get what I'm saying? So sometimes, like, if you guys are invited, I told you, you Jackie can attest. When you guys were invited, I, I don't have no reason not to like Malaysia. Yes. We didn't even have a conversation about Malaysia. I don't have no reason. Like like exactly. Her. I don't have no reason not to like her. You, you guys have your thing. I'm going to take it back. I'm going to try to get to know her. You can ask those ladies out there. I literally told them, when you go meet them, make your own judgment. But I just want that in return. I just want, and then I'm going to let you guys start some money so we be talking. Um, I just want to make it very clear that... It's not a, 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 a this side versus that side, this house versus that house. Your experiences, and this is my opinion, I feel like sometimes are, in my opinion, in my eyes, are skewed and, and twisted to fit into this little bubble of colorism and racism. Okay, that, see, I think we're doing it again. No, no, we're not. I'm not trying to do it again. I just, we are I doing it. I literally just, I tried to erase the slate, and we're doing it again. Okay. Stop trying okay. to tell me how to feel. Stop I'm trying to, you said, I think I said, that, these are, this is my opinion. I wasn't trying to tell you how to feel at all. I'm not misconstruing nothing. So, okay. You, I'm you're not right twisting, in my opinion. No, okay. I'm just letting you know, I'm not twisting anything. Okay. And the reason why I know I'm not is because the world However we were presented, however we were presented, the world has made their own decision. And to be honest to you, both of you guys, I feel like these conversations are happening now, a year and a half later, because you guys cannot handle the backlash you received from the world. Which is my opinion. That's why I think these conversations are happening now. Because you do have my Instagram and we have DM'd in the past. 
You are not on my Instagram because I blocked you a year or two ago. But I didn't have a problem with the one monkey don't stop no show. Before. But you didn't know that. I didn't. Yes, I didn't. I, lied, so I did I didn't not think play I had into to. that. Yeah. I'm just telling you. The so I didn't think I had to DM you because it didn't have nothing to do with you. Okay, so that's a different, that's yeah. a different subject. With you, you have. I mean, Thomas has Kwame's number. You know that. I mean, Kwame has Thomas's number. If we really wanted to get in contact with each other, we could. Mm -hmm. I'll just put it to you like that, okay? So we did it, and I felt like I didn't have to extend all the branch because I felt like I already said at the showcase, the music showcase, we're good. So when we kept moving forward, and then comes to Costa Rica, I'm like, you know what? I just want them to talk. I don't know how my sis feels. I don't know how you feel, go talk. But when you start backlashing to me, I'm like, how can I be good with somebody who's already, to me, got an attitude? So I'm, how can we keep going backwards? Right now, I literally just said, let's not do this, let's not repeat this in history, and then you took it back. I'm not gonna agree with you on the colorism thing, because I, I stand firm on my position. I think there's a colorism issue in this group. How it's gonna get fixed, I don't know. I'm not gonna change my position, I still believe that. I know what I experienced, so I can't expect you. You just to had the one experience, though. No, no, it's not one experience, and I'm, I'm, I don't even want to keep going down into it because I'm currently being sued. You're not being sued. You're not being sued. You're not being sued. You guys all were in Amsterdam when our other homegirl was called Lingling. Nobody jumped on that. Nobody jumped on that. An apology was issued immediately to her, written and verbal. Right? So CC said in that moment, you're a racist. I don't have to keep bringing up examples. I know what I experienced. And listen, sis, I have told you already, no one can tell you how you feel. Absolutely. All I'm saying is when that was said to CC about the lean lean thing, we don't jump in each other's arguments because we all say a bunch mm -hmm. of stuff to each other over the years. At the end of the day, sisters argue sisters. Sister, sisters argue sisters fight, just like we all know. Okay. So all I'm saying is we take accountability. Nobody said we're sorry, so. but but I'm not saying no, I get it. But I was just saying that was the reason when you said nobody stepped in. I didn't say nobody stepped in. I said, I said, nobody said, in. I said she got an apology, right. and she got it from Evelyn. She I said, said she got an apology. I said nobody. The example I'm giving, just for clarity, yeah, just so this is thing. when CC was called lingering right. and Cece's immediate response was you're being a racist her immediate response was to answer the question somebody said what is that oh Cece said what does that mean she says the nail shop girl she asked me I know I knew that yeah I'm not like, you girl I'm saying what the big yeah, operation yeah I'm like listen no I understand you, you not, gave clarity I gave clarity because this like, is getting way it, it is over because context because I'm not guilty <laughs> I'm literally just saying what happened to refresh everyone's memory I'm not guilty you. My point is, you knew immediately it was a racist derogatory name. Cece knew immediately it was a racist derogatory name. Cece got an apology immediately after Cece said she was a racist. Okay? Cece did not get a lawsuit. Okay, so what did, what did Evelyn do to you? Because maybe you would have gotten an apology. Maybe, maybe you guys, maybe you would have gotten an apology like Cece did because she knew exactly which one it was. Girl, like, come on. Can I ask you two a question on, since we are um, newer to your circles? Mm -hmm. Have you guys had these types of things in the past and people have, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, is this something new that is happening? Have you had people come in and out of your circle or in and out of your circle who have, I don't know, God, but I'm trying to figure out why it, this is happening. So we can move the fuck This forward. is not new. Okay. I'm going, I have an idea what might help. I think this is great where we are right now. I think before it escalates to something even yes. bigger or goes backwards, because yeah. everybody needs to take a moment. I think this was a great first step it in talking. Is. I'm, I'm not even going to say I commend everybody, because this is something sisters do. We're going through something. Let's just take a moment to breathe and come back to it a little bit later if you guys are good with that until we can figure out and now you've, you've shared some more stuff with these guys and now Malaysia gets her take on it it's not coming from Kristen back to the house Malaysia actually heard so you know we'll come back together and I have an idea and we'll see where it goes um, I'm, what I'm getting is, you know, you threw out that I bleach my skin, I get a couple of those, and that's that's. Do you want me to show you the message yeah. in the picture? Because there's a picture. You can do whatever okay. you want. No, I'm just that, asking that you. If you want it, I will show it to you. I'm going to tell you on my life, on my children's life, I know what I have done. 
I've never purchased anything. I go to estheticians to make sure my skin looks nice, and then that's that. So you can fabricate and do whatever you want to do. I'm fine with that. What I'm saying is those things hurt me as well as you have hurt too, and I held it in. And so unfortunately, we couldn't come to a resolution. I didn't think we were today. Mm -hmm. um, but I just wanted you to know how I feel because, I mean, I don't know. I can walk out of here and not come back. No, I want you so to come back. back. You that's just that. <laughs> Listen, talking about tomorrow is not promised. That's yeah. yeah. <laughs> I want you to come back. So, you know. If you guys would think about it. Yeah. She was saying she was saying like not. Oh, she was saying she was like she was like tomorrow is not promised. Like she don't know tomorrow is not promised type of thing. So she would hate to leave things on that. Exactly. And walking in the store, I already knew what I was gonna say, what my intentions were. That's why I really didn't want to play a game. I wanted to get straight to business. That's just what it is. That's how I am. When I got my man made up, my mind's made up. I'm a stubborn ass Leo. Yeah. So that's that. Um, I will infringe on you guys time anymore let you guys go back and play your game or whatever mm -hmm. but from us and the collective <laughs> y'all love that word now <laughs> the collective y'all love the word we gotta move this. forward okay? okay okay and um honey we're always gonna talk behind each other's back yeah one step at a time bitch okay Thank you guys for coming. Hey, thank you. Y'all have a good one. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Give hugs, everybody. Even if it's not that big hugs. We got it on the back end. Oh, okay. All right, let's get this quick before we go back. Bye, y'all. Someone, I know these guys are mad at her. I'm, I'm sorry. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I'm not mad at you, too. Bye. I think so. What are they doing? You know, we haven't even came out here, huh? So I feel, I feel, I've been feeling nauseously the last couple of days. You coming? Come on. I didn't even listen to that. No, no, I didn't even come here, baby. Listen, <laughs> I'm so I mean, nauseous. I, I'm I mean, sorry. Right, before they come, I want to say this, and I want you to say it. I'm so proud of you being able to sit there, express yourself, and again, mm -hmm. patience. You it listen. takes a lot of patience. It is, but it takes hey. a lot of patience. These are baby steps, so you like you said when we first got here, you know, baby steps. Right. right. You know, so what you need. Right. So how do you feel? Yeah. I feel fine. At the end of the day, it's like what I what I want to make sure that gets across is that you cannot keep trying to tell somebody something to it fits what you want. Yeah. I stand firm in my position, I know what I experience. Whether they agree with me or not, it's up to them. But I'm going through a lot of stuff outside of this. So they don't understand because I don't share with them because I don't trust them. So until trust is developed, yeah. Only, only time will tell. Yeah. Only time will tell. So. Well, <laughs> hey, I didn't expect that, and I'm like, Ooh. all kinds of stuff is bound to happen here. Yeah. It's always something. Like I, I just thought they was gonna pop over and play a game, and they say, you know, we don't have to come to Jesus moment. So, I mean, and it's a little that. one. But hey, yeah. steps or steps. Steps or steps. We'll take that. Are they coming or no? You guys coming? Look, they mad at us. <laughs> Cause they don't even fuck with us. Yeah, but get involved in the game or nothing. So she can't be mad now that it didn't get resolved. Right, right, right. Don't want to involve it. Ooh, it's cold. Hey, ladies. Hey. What are you guys doing? Come on, it's got this cold out. It's really cold. Oh, the ladies getting in the pool with me? No, hell no. Nah. I'm just trying to get in that pool. Why you guys want to relax for a minute before we get ready to cook? Because I'm hungry. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's freezing. Yeah. Yeah. I need that. I need that thing on my blanket. You do? It is so freaking cold. Oh, oh my God. It's cold. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God.
season cold. Oh my god. Right? This is a season like you don't remember this so y'all kinda need baby steps. Baby steps. It's cold, it's cold, it's cold. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It, it's just really, um, I just, for me, I've been surprised. I invited the guys to people to say, so I don't want you to feel like this, but it, like I said, I said, that it wasn't an ambush because it wasn't, so it's just coming in. I think it was heavy on my part, and they just really, they didn't want to pose me. Like she said, they just wanted to talk to me and tell you how they felt and apologize and, you know, try to start the steps of something. Right. So, baby steps, like you said. Mm -hmm. Baby steps indeed, girl. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, you got the line. You got your blanket? Yes, please, no. Please, So we lost that game. Who did that? Oh, she did. <laughs> if you guys want, you can get everybody a drink. You're warm up. What do you guys want? I'm the host. I'll do it. Yeah. Oh, you do it? Oh, you don't want to show up? Yeah. What do you want to do? Okay. You're going to drink these. You're going to drink all day. You're going to just relax. You're going to start cooking because then we're going to be on our feet. Well, you don't just because you're going to be on our feet all day. What do you want? Do you want to Oh, it's cold, it's cold, it's cold. You want something? No, no, no. Just a small amount? I'll put it in it. Yeah. What do you want? Oh, you, no. Okay. So, can you find a beautiful thing for that? Yeah, we got it. Thank you. Thank you. That's so nice. Okay. Okay. She put one of your moves out. She's like, I've seen I'm going to learn this. 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 Mm -hmm. That was a lucky one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we forgot our shoes. Oh! <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.
let's give it a, a breather because I, I really understand that and let's try something. I don't know if it'll work, it might blow up in my face, but let's try something. We're going to try every damn thing we can while we're here. Can I try this next two weeks? Can I see your eyelashes? Because I was talking about your eyelashes. Why do you want? Now, see, you're talking. No, you're talking. No, you're talking. Oh, you're talking shit about my eyelashes. See, you, 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 you are crazy. You own me, sir. You're talking shit. You too. Listen, I'm not a fan. I don't know what my lady's saying, and every, we, we'll, let's try something. Unless you Wait, is that kind of fun? Is that kind of fun? No, no, no. How can yeah. we, how, how can we to... all come together around each other and be yourself if you don't know what it is that you did to harm yeah. or hurt someone? Because yeah. like, you said that Phoebe called you the name. And you guys laughed and you guys co okay. and I gave the analogy. So, so, that's that. we, hurt, so cool. we hurt you too for laughing. Mm -hmm. No, it's not, I'm not hurt. Oh. I've never said anything about feelings. I, 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 so I'm saying for the other ladies, say if we wanted to come to the bad bitch ball, how do we all come to the bad bitch ball if we're uh, unsure of what it is that made you feel like that, you know, those two people in particular were colored? I didn't, I, I still have not named anyone. Oh, I still have not pointed a finger at anyone. I will say it again. This group. Everybody included. Me? Everybody included will include everybody because we have all, we all, different levels, okay? This is colorism. This is not, I'm not saying any mom here. If a mother says to their child, wake your black ass up. White parents do not say, wake your white ass up. It is a problem in the black community. And I will get deeper when we have your little thing. Okay. Let, let, they they did it. It's deep. No, I don't want to just talk about, about it. Right now, too. And like she said, she doesn't want to continue talking about it. This is all news to me. Thank you, guys. That's funny. I didn't know to me. So uh, now I see. It's, it's, it's I'm going to tell you. I just want to know when we come back. Do you mind when you go? Or not yet? I'm going to take a step. Okay. Come on. They come in glass. You can come it's so cold out there, and I, I'm not even going to touch on the last Girl, segment I, situation of us talking. I am so because yeah. I'm like, we we're just going to put that baby to bed, and we're going to deal with that later. But anyway. Um, it was a very interesting conversation. I'm not going to be the one to talk about what it was because it wasn't based on me. It was more, oh, you saw let her, or we could talk about something else. At the end of the day, does everybody understand what colorism is? Like, pretty much? Okay. Because it seems like, um, it, it's like anyone here and not the other. I feel like every time we make a baby step, for progress, they do something and take us back a little bit. So I can't keep going in circles. I'm going to try something different. I don't know what it is yet, but I'm going to try something different in terms of how I deal with the people in this group. Because I don't have to explain myself to anyone, and I've been really cordial to do that. Well, you know, not only are we for your answers, and that's why I'm very careful in saying anything, interjecting anything. Mm -hmm. Because this is an opportunity for them not to hear it from me. I don't speak for you. I don't put words in your mouth. Mm -hmm. But then hear it from you. I'm there in support of my sis. I just heard tonight that you feel every one of us, excluding these guys that just got here, Nia and Maria, but all of us are colorists, including Jennifer. Including all of us. I said I believe there's a color. I mean, it's not me and she said everyone. I said, we're that many. So my friends, I'm the man. I'm the man. Jackie, Jackie, now you're the man. I did not say you guys are colorless. I said there is a colorism okay. issue. That's what a I colorism said. issue means. I gave so many analogies, it's like, fuck. Yeah. If a mother says, wake your ass up, and you're like, okay, I'm not going to do that. Mm -hmm. This is an analogy so that I can break it down so that certain people who stay not getting it can mm -hmm. get it. If a mother says to their child, make your black ass up. You and your nappy ass hair. <clears throat> These are terms of colorism. You will almost never hear a white mom. Can I finish? 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 Yeah, but I don't. I'm not going to talk about it. It's fine. 
see, and this is what I'm saying. We don't want any, we don't want to have, it's got to be dealt with and it will be. Let's just take a breather from yeah, that. Some yeah. stuff, you know, have gotten discussed tonight. I understand what we're saying. Let's not let it blow off the energy of this house. We've been through a, you know, a roller coaster since we've been here. It's okay. I don't take offense, and I want you to know that, to what you said. I'm, you know, I'm always willing to listen and, and learn. We talk all the time. Mm -hmm. And if that's how you feel, well, I'm going to jump right on you, eat first, and I'm not going to do shit. So when you do educate me on what it is, I may know my version of what it is, but I don't know what your version of it is. It's like that I think that there is a definition. Exactly. So whatever that is, you're going to move forward in a positive direction. I don't want no finger pointing. I don't want to know everybody. Are you feeling like, why is everyone questioning me and putting me in questions? And we have yeah. to answer real soon if everybody doesn't let it just come out naturally. Like, right. I'm, I've been real cautious and real good at letting people get their point across, and it's not being reciprocated. So I'm going to just chill out and enjoy my stay here and right. allow everybody to, oh, everybody else to carry, carry the vacation. I'm going to try whatever. Like, it's okay, but I do want us to have a good time. Mm -hmm. I, you know, I'm glad they came over. I asked if they would want to talk to you, Jennifer. They declined. Um, you know, that'll, that'll, everything will be worked out however it needs to be as we go on. The days are long and we've got a lot of time left. But, yeah, I don't, I, that's fine that you asked them, but I have... I don't have any desire. I do. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. I don't, like I'm still processing what you told me about mm -hmm. what Christian did. That's right. So it's like, you talking about you don't have no desire. Bitch, I don't have no desire to talk to you. You over here lying on me. Like, let me, let me, work, let me work through that and figure out why you doing fuck shit. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I mm -hmm. see what I said, bro. You, you don't have to say I'm very cool. It, it doesn't even matter. My thing is like, no matter what the conversation is, like, I'm good. Yeah. 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 That's fine, Jimmy. Listen, what do you need to do about it? Because I'm going to tell you what I'm 